Today we're in Yamba, my hometown. I, I grew up, and uh, yeah, they've they've named one of the, the rugby ovals here, the, the Kane Douglas Field. So it's, yeah, it's a massive occasion for me and my family. How's it going? You having fun? Yeah, yeah. yeah. A bit better than Kane's team yesterday. They used to get five five while in bar. No, we we won the comp under 17s. No, it's crazy that I was I would have been seen on the other side when I was little, doing the same thing, and when anyone I looked up to came back. Pretty cool to see that the juniors is going strong because I didn't really start till yeah, I was 15. Like I'd, I played league and other sports sort of growing up until there was rugby. He's a goal kicker actually. He kicked goals in under 15. Didn't, didn't get many, but <laughs> he did kick them. Yeah. Rugby is not just a sport or a game, it's a way of life. And uh, Kane's a great example of someone who's embraced that. Played uh, 30 odd test matches. It's taken him everywhere and done everything for him. And that's what rugby can do for you. There we go. I'm He's the only person who's ever played at uh, international level, and it really inspires people to perform at their highest level, and it's a good community feel. Like, all week there's been a build-up in Yamba about we've got the Kane Douglas name in today, and it's just been really lovely to be part of that community. The absolute glow of pride, and he'll never let that back down. He, you know, they know where they're from, and they know that um, that they've got to give back eventually. As I said to them, I will not be biased to the Amber. Vice versa to you guys, I will not. Be... <laughs> well, you would have killed. He's only wearing his jersey a couple of years ago, hasn't he? Yeah, he knows the rules because he used to break them all. <laughs> yeah, well, that's, that's rugby in the final coast. It's you, you get the, the ref. The ref's one of the locals from the, the local club, probably. So, yeah, I suppose that they get a few backpackers and stuff, and sort of move to town, and then they end up staying for the year. So they get a few guys like that who end up signing up with the club and here for the whole season. But um, yeah, I, I know, I know, 70% of the team. It'll, it'll always be home, remember? I feel pretty chuffed, pretty honoured that I've, I've got a field named after me and then seen, seen all the little kids come up and want an autograph and it, do, it does make you think that, that the things I've done and might, might give someone else hope that they can have dreams of doing that one day. Gonna blow a kiss. <laughs>